put your sunglasses on, you're gonna need it. Hey everyone, it's Liz. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the full face of highlighter challenge. Guys, I've been waiting to do this for weeks, like literally for weeks, and I'm so excited. Um, this look, you know, I'm not even gonna say that I hate it because I actually kind of like it. Call me crazy, I know, because I am just a smidgen crazy. <laughs> But I think this actually looks pretty dang nice and I think it's the look of the future, you know? So I really hope that you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I had so much fun doing it. Do not take any of it to heart because everything that is said in this video is just comedy. It's just funny. I'm just trying to be funny. Even though I'm not funny. I know I'm not funny. I'm sorry. So if you are new here, hi, hello, my name is Liz. I like beauty and fashion. You can follow me on my social media links and you can subscribe to my channel by just clicking this button right here or somewhere down here, down here, somewhere. I used to be up there. I don't even know anymore. So without further ado, let's get on with this video. So put your sunglasses on because this is about to be one bright video. So first off, I'm going to be using my Photo Finish Primer Water. I'm just going to spray that on my face. Oh. Yeah, that feels so nice, especially because it is so humid outside. Reason being why my hair is up right now. It's probably all frizzy and, oh my gosh, just everywhere. Everywhere. Now I'm going to be using Benefits Pore Fashionelle. I'm putting that all over my face as well, just to cover up all those pores so our face can, you know, shine bright. I really just concentrated more on my nose area because that is the area that has the most pores, obviously, because that's where pores like to live. So, so next I'm going to be using my L'Oreal Magic Lumi Light Infusing Primer, and this is supposed to just make your face glow even more, so exactly what we want from this right now to glow, 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 and glow some more. I'm going to use my stippling brush to apply this because I'm going to be using this as a foundation because, you know, the shinier the better. That is where it's at. Do you see that? Guys, I might be doing this uh, like every day because this is going to cancel out my, um, you know, my dark under eye circles. It's all you need in life. I can see a huge difference in my face and I think it is looking great. I was so excited to see everyone doing this challenge because I thought it was hilarious and now I'm doing it because uh, obviously I was really late onto this bandwagon. Um, but you know what? Better late than never, right? Oh yeah. Look at that glow. Next I'm going to be taking NARS Coco Cabana. I'm going to use this as kind of like a highlighter primer as well. So it makes me, you know, glow up more. Mmm. Oh yeah. Oh man. I forgot how much I like this stuff. Put that on that nose, you know. Let it glow. Let it glow, let it glow. Don't forget that neck. I almost forgot. We want all the glow in the whole entire world. Next I'm going to be taking Mystery Princess and this is from the MAC Cinderella collab and I'm going to be using that underneath my eyes. I'm just going to kind of bake my eye. If, you, if there's a highlighter baker out there, sure. So now I'm going to be taking this Too Faced palette, and excuse me, I forget what the name of this palette is, but I will have it down below. I'm going to be using the color Sun Bunny, and it's this right here, as a contour. Alright, so now I'm going to contour my face. Oh my gosh, ready? This is going to be intense. really my 
routine, give or take a few things, you know? So for blush, I'm just going to use something light, you know? So I'm going to be taking this Sephora palette in Overcast Filter. This is probably like an old palette. Um, and this is in the color Hashtag Happy Days. And it's this top color up here. I'm just going to use that as my blush. Mm. Oh yeah, that mm. This gives a very nice, soft, subtle pink you know, just perfect for, you know, everything, so. Perfect. Now for my highlighter. Of course, I'm going to be using the Becca Champagne Pop because what else do you use for a highlighter, right? I mean, this is the only highlighter I've really been using other than a few other ones. It's also one of my favorite highlighters. I think it's great on, like, all skin tones, so that's always so nice because I'm always looking for things that look good on every kind of skin tone, you know? So I'm just going to, oh, oh my gosh, this is, this is something else. This is perfect. I think it blends in everything so nicely. Just dabble that. Oh, guys, I am, um, this, this must be the best video I think I've ever made, ever. So next I'm going to be going in with the same Too Faced palette and I'm going to be taking the color Flushed, which is right here, and this color up here, it's Satin Sheets, and I'm going to use that on my eye. I'm also going to cheat a little, I'm going to use a few like highlighter-esque eyeshadows as well because, you know, I want to make this look my everyday look. Okay, so I'm taking Flushed right now, I'm just going to put that right on my lid. Now I'm going to take satin sheets, and I'm also going to put that on my lip, but just a little bit higher. It's kind of blending in both of these colors, because I want the pink and the yellow to kind of mix in. Next I'm going to be taking this Kardashian palette, which is so old, I don't even know when I got this. I should probably throw it away by now, but I really never used it, so I'm going to go in with this. And there's some really nice dark chrome colors, so I'm just kind of darking up this look, and I'm going to use this one right here. It's like this gunmetal color. I'm going to use that on the outside corners, kind of bringing it in to the eye. And I just want to make my eyes look really subtle. I don't want anything, you know, too dramatic or anything. I just want to bring in a new like color because I have so many golds on my eye. I should probably just keep on going with golds, but you know what? I think the silver is acting very nicely. It's giving me a nice smoky eye. Don't forget your eyebrows. I almost forgot my eyebrows. Who am I? I'm just going back in with Snow Bunny from the Too Faced palette and I'm just going to put that right in my eyes. And I'm also going to take a Daydreamer from that palette as well because nobody's a little light for my eyebrows, but you know what? Whatever it is, a YOLO. Do they glisten? Mm hmm. Now I'm going to be taking the Revlon Photo Ready Eye Art and I'm just going to take the glitter because, you know, why not? It's glitter. I like glitter. put that right on my lid. Now I'm going to take Benefits what up, What's Up. I have this little mini size of this. How cute is this? Um, I got it from Sephora as like a beauty insider gift. So, woo! Love being a beauty insider. I'm just going to, you know, highlight that nose a little bit more because I feel like it needs a little extra attention. So now I'm going to be using my gel eyeliner. I will be right back because this takes me a little while. I'm still kind of, you know, learning how to do this on camera because this is new and I'm not a professional at eyeliner so BRB okay so I just did my eyeliner and I was gonna put on fake eyelashes and then I remembered that I ran out of glue fun so lesson learned do not leave your glue cap off all night actually all week so that it can dry it up 
So now I'm going to take L'Oreal's Carbon Black Luminous Eye Mascara. So last but not least, I'm going to be using Max Pet Me Please and uh, this, this stuff. You can see it glowing from here. It's not even focused. Oh yeah. It's happening. Give me some! Oh my god, guys. This. It's amazing! Alright, so this is the finished look. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this. I really wish that I had lashes to go with this, but I think my eye, I mean, you can't see from here, but in real life, I feel like my eyelashes are pretty long, so... So this is all fun and games. I really hope that you guys took this very lightly. This isn't how I do my face every single day. There are some techniques that I do that I use every single day, but this, um, this look, maybe, you know, maybe, when it's accepted into society, I will wear it because, I mean, my face is glowing right now. Like, absolutely glowing. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Don't forget to follow me on social media links. Everything is at Elizabeth Hope. I made sure of that. Like, all those links are all mine. I'm pretty sure. You can and if you're not subscribed, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. And yeah, that's it. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye!